Welcome to East Coast Oak Reviews. Today, we're reviewing Schlitz. This is an American adjunct lager. Doesn't say it on the bottle, but I had to look it up on Beer Advocate. It's clocking in at 4.6% alcohol by volume. And this is from Pabst Brewing Company. So, uh, yeah, I saw this in Massachusetts the other day. I've never tried it. Um, well, I've had it already, uh, but I saved a bottle for the review. But uh, yeah, I grabbed the six pack because I never had Schlitz before. Uh, save the bottle for the review. Um, today is November 26th, 2022. And the, uh, this is the best buy date. This is January 2nd, 2023 on the side. See that there? Um, so it is still fresh. Uh, a little spendy for an American adjunct lager six pack. I believe I paid around eight bucks. Um, so right around the same price that you pay for like Budweiser. Uh, but yeah, let's, uh, without further ado, let's crack this open. Go for the pour. This is a twist top bottle. Pour it up in my pub glass here. It's been a while since I've done a American adjunct lager review. Um, I do enjoy them. Uh, crystal clear, golden color, lots of nice effervescence. See those bubbles. It's got this uh, frothy white head, about a half a finger ahead. Seems to be holding a good amount of retention. Um, yeah, looks like your typical American adjunct lager. Very clean, golden looking in color. And uh, yeah, nose. Good amount of the corn. There's actually a little bit uh, more of a um, floral grassiness to this one. Some malt sweetness, a little biscuity bready as well. It's actually a little citrusy. There's a little bit of like a lemon, like a, a lemon grass, like le lemon grassy flavor, I guess you could say. But yeah, not super corn forward like some of these adjunct lagers are. Sometimes they're just super corn syrup. This one seems a little bit more subdued. Picking up a little bit more of the other ingredients rather than just uh, the adjunct. But uh, yeah, overall it smells super crisp and clean. There's no like metallic like aromas. Um, there's nothing offensive on the aroma. Yeah, without further ado, let's dive into this. Cheers. Decent carbonation. I'd say it's about medium carbonation. It's not as like prickly and spritzy as like a Miller Light or a Coors Light. There's a good amount of corn sweetness on the palate, um, but you're still left with a good amount of uh, malts. And yeah, it's got a little bit of that floral grassy lemony aftertaste. I wouldn't necessarily call it bitter. There's a little bit of a tartness as well. Super crisp, drinkable, refreshing, definitely light bodied. It's not like super syrupy, like some of the other adjunct lagers with the heavy amounts of corn syrup. I think it's got a, a good amount of adjunct in it, not overpowering, um, nothing offensive on the palate as well. Just a super easy drinking, crushable 4.6 American adjunct lager. I wish that they uh, weren't so expensive. I would honestly, I would pick this up over some of the other brands. Um, but like I said, $8 for a six pack of 12 ounce bottles is definitely a little spendy. Uh, that's right around, like I said, like Budweiser range. And typically when I buy these types of beers, I usually go for like Miller Lite. I can get a six pack of Miller Lite for them. Um, 550 um and then even like bush light and then if you get to the jenny cream ales those are like three bucks three uh three dollars fifty cents for a six pack um but yeah this is definitely a uh, a pretty dang good uh american adjunct clogger in my opinion number on this i'll go 85 i definitely think it's worth it um like i said it's just a little spendy for what it is but overall uh, a really easy sip of beer, super crushable, 
like I said, nothing offensive. No, I'd have no problem drinking a six pack of these. Gonna recommend it all day. Um, if you can get Slits or if you never had it before, um, this is actually one of the beers that I've been looking for for a while. Um, one of the American adjunct lagers. I wasn't able to try. I was super excited to try it. I had their uh, the Slits, the Gold Bowl, which is their, it's a malt liquor. I think it's like 8.5, it's like a high gravity malt liquor. Uh, but yeah, I haven't seen the, the regular Schlitz, the original, until now. And um, I was super excited to pick up six pack, super excited to review it. And yeah, like I said, I'm gonna recommend it. Um, it would be cool to find it in cans one day, maybe for, even for a cheaper price. And uh, yeah, with that being said, um, if there's anything else that you guys like to see on my channel, make sure to leave a comment down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for upcoming videos. I like your beer. Thanks for watching, guys. Cheers.